to do some gardening. <laughs> and we have a gardening expert here. Really needs no introduction. He's known to millions of people, and he's joining us live in studio. This is so exciting. So, Ed Hume, thank you so much for being here. Well, thank you. Good morning. And thank you for introducing me as an expert. <laughs> X is an unknown factor, and PERT is a drip under pressure. <laughs> So I'm under pressure today. No, oh, no, not you're not. Actually, no, I, I bought some. I was just telling you during the break, I bought some Ed Hume seeds the other day. I wish I'd known. I would have brought them and had you sign them for me. Oh, yeah. shoot. <laughs> <laughs> Darn. So the reason we have you on this morning is because basically for the first time in 52 years, your gardening show will not be on the air after tomorrow, after today. After today. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the very last time. Darn it. I know. My goodness. <laughs> and always in Seattle. And uh, we were on King Stations for about 35 years. Oh, that's incredible. Yeah. Oh, goodness. So. What were some of your highlights? Oh, gosh. There's so many. <laughs> you know, I, I've got to tell you, one of the things that I really enjoyed was um, we did a Christmas show for 10 years here on King. It was called Deck the Halls, and it was with my wife and with the kids, okay. our two boys. And uh, the last couple of years, we did it with the King's Queen, B. Donovan. Oh. Uh, and uh, it, that was really fun. Yeah. Did and we, got, you know, we got about 40,000 pieces of mail each year on oh that my show. Gosh. Really? Yeah. Did you, now what would you decorate? Um, Various. Well, my wife showed this was at a time when Seattle's economy wasn't very good, unfortunately. <laughs> yeah. So I remember the sign on uh, the freeway, or no, it was on Highway 99, I said. It said, the last person out, please turn off the light. <laughs> 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 it was that bad. Oh, so, man. So she had all kinds of ideas that people could make for Christmas. Mm -hmm. See and give us Christmas gifts. Wonderful. Yeah. So yeah, it was a great show, and they could write in then for the directions, and that's why we got the forty thousand pieces of mail. Amazing, forty thousand. That's Wouldn't unheard of. What has yes. it been like? I mean, you've had to have seen how much has television changed in the last just thirty-five years in your eyes here in well, Seattle. In the 50 years, not much, <laughs> because it <was laughs> black and white, no, it's, <laughs> no, it really has changed. Uh, in, in the last 35 years, even more, yeah. because mm -hmm. so, much, so much of it's automated, of course. And uh, in our cases, um, the gardening sections get smaller and smaller and smaller, mm -hmm. you know, on television. But you really, you know, paved the way for so many people. You know, we often have Cisco on here, yeah. too. I, oh, he's a neat guy. Oh, he's, he's neat. Great. You're a neat guy. So. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, oh, go ahead. Um, yeah, no, but I mean, it's just, it's so rare, I think, specifically to Seattle, um, that we have so many local shows. You don't see that in a lot of uh, cities anymore, the shows that are just local, like we have right. Evening Magazine and all these things. Um, do you think... That there's going to be a bit gone with you guys when, when, when we're not going to be able to turn it on and see anymore. I, there's going to be that day. It's getting, uh, the shows, as I mentioned, are getting uh, narrower and narrower mm -hmm. all the time. Yeah, and yeah. It, they, it will get that way. Are you going to have a watch party today? Yeah. Yeah, I wish. <laughs> <laughs> Can I share something yes, with you? Sure. Yes, sure. I was wondering what this That's was. That's all no. king. Okay. And I have never, I wore this one segment, uh, and it was so hot under the lights. And this was, you know, probably 35 years ago here on King. This sweater, and the, my signature was to wear a sweater with no sleeves. Oh. Okay, and I did that every show I was ever on on King and, and their sister stations. Mm -hmm. This sweater was given to me and knitted by Mrs. Bullock. Kidding. Yeah, no and I have way. never shared that with anybody. Of course, she's gone. So, so if, yeah, isn't if, that neat? If you're home and you don't know, our television station was started by Dorothy Bullitt. Um, yeah. Oh my goodness. A, one of a pioneer in in broadcasting, and especially a, a pioneering woman as well. That is incredible. Isn't it something? That else? is beautiful. Yeah, and Thank she did it by so hand. Well. Oh my gosh, yeah. this is gorgeous. Yeah, that's incredible. A woman of many talents, apparently. Yeah. yeah. And then you brought your book? Oh, that, yeah. yeah, that's my latest book. Okay. And uh, it's my favorite. However, my second favorite is one I wrote for the kids, mm -hmm. and it was called How to Plant a Bunch of Stuff. 
<laughs> and it was written in conjunction with Weedle on the Needle, oh, which was a very big yes, thing in yes. Seattle history as well. How yeah, to plant a fun. bunch of stuff. Yeah, exactly. It was fun. We're going to have to find it. Well, it, we didn't really get to talk about any plants, but... <laughs> no, I no. I just brought those as props. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so we able to find you. Now yeah. the show's over. Okay, well... Uh, you know, of course, on Facebook and uh, any of the social media, or not any of it, but most of the. You social don't have media. handlers doing that for you. You're on Facebook for yourself. Yeah. Well, no. I, <laughs> my, fortunately, my granddaughter does. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's almost out of the reach for me. Okay, yeah. <laughs> wow. Well, thank you so much for being here, and what an well, honor and a treat it was to have well, you and have you in pleasure. this market for more than five decades. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You will be missed. Oh, uh, thank you, and thanks for asking me. It's been fun. It's been fun meeting you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we loved it. We'll be right back.